Oh, wow, thank you. Um, Chancellor, fellow graduates, ladies and gentlemen, thank you very much. I'd just like to start off by saying thanks to Professor Gordon Campbell for his kind words. It's a great honor and privilege to be stood here today. My most sincere thanks to the University of Leicester and Dr. E. Parker for having organized all of this. You have no idea how much this means to me. Uh, a degree is something that I had always wanted but had thought it was something that had just passed me by. So I feel very fortunate to be stood here right now, especially in this rather fetching gown. I know my, uh, my mum will love it. <laughs> uh, recently, um, I've been thinking a lot about the decisions and choices we make in our lives. And it occurred to me that you are not always able to control every moment of your life, and uh, sometimes that's okay. Suppose what I'm about to say is something I'm sure you're all well aware of, but it's sometimes good to just be reminded of it. Throughout life, you will set yourself challenges and goals, and sometimes it may feel like it's not going your way. But the one thing that you should trust is in your belief, in yourself, that as long as you recognize the signs that life offers you and you grab those opportunities, doors will open up for you. When there's times you feel stuck or down, try doing at least one new thing once a week, whether it be sat on a different part of the sofa or going on a roller coaster ride, even if you're absolutely petrified. The inspirations of my life were, God, <laughs> getting emotional. Um, the inspirations in my life were right there under my nose. My mother, my family, and amazing mentors who have come and gone throughout my life but people who I've always remembered. So sorry, I'm about to cry. Uh, <laughs> I come from a very normal background, and the two things that stick with me are my mother's words of, if there's a roof over your head and food on the table, then everything will be fine. And secondly, my first agent, Joan Brown, in reference to my career, if there's two reasons to do something, do it. If you're going to learn something from it or if it's going to move you forward. A big, big congratulations to all of you who are sat here today having achieved so much already. Here's to your future, your challenges, and your goals. It's only just begun. Enjoy it. <laughs>